the risk is we can call it as zero lesser than zero also because there is no risk if you're not one year if you go after 50 years also your money will be safe with SBI. What is a money market? Money market always goes with short term. Usually it starts from 14 days. It will go up to one year. Up to one year, whatever the trading happens, that we call it as money market. In the money market, always we go with the short term lesser than one year. A warm welcome to one and all. This is your Radha sir here. Lecturing with us from first grade college, the temple of excellence. Now we are discussing your session four of unit four, financial market and services. In this, we discuss about financial market and its instruments. Now, financial market and instrument. Now, you already learned what is a financial market. What are the financial services and what is financial system? Today, we discuss about financial market and instrument, which are the instrument which helps or which support us for the financial investments. First, we'll understand what is financial market. Now, financial market is a word that describe the marketplace where the bonds, equity, security, currency, are traded. What is a financial market? Financial market, you know that. For example, if you go, if you want to buy a vegetable, so what you will do with the vegetable and all? You will go to market and you will buy vegetable. Similarly, if you want anything, any food, grocery, provisions, everything, you will go to market and buy. Similarly, related to finance, there is a financial market where you can buy bonds, equity, security, Currencies are traded, traded in the sense exchange, so that you will invest in something, you will get a bond. You will invest in some security or shares, you will get security certificate for that. You will invest in some stock or something, in return you will get a certificate or authorization things or documents for the investment. So, few financial market do a security business of trillions of dollars daily. So we always seen lakhs crores together, but it goes with trillions of dollar per day. Now, and some are small scale with less activity. These are market where businesses grow their cash, companies decrease risk and investors make more cash. It is very simple. There are two kinds of markets are there. Few markets, it is like you have a huge risk the returns also more. Few markets are there, the returns are very less because the risk also very less. In the previous class, I gave you an example of SBI. If you invest in SBI of 10 lakh rupees, at the end of one year, you will get 10 lakh 60,000. So here the risk is we can call it as zero, lesser than zero also because there is no risk. If you're not one year, if you go after 50 years also, your money will be safe with SBI. It will be your interest will be added, compound interest will be added, everything will be added. You will get a huge amount, huge amount in the sense returns will be less but guaranteed amount you will get from this investment. This is called your safest way. Always when you go to a small market, the returns will be less, risk also less. When you go to big market, the returns will be more as well as risk also huge. Types of financial market. What are the types you have in the financial market? The major types are over the counter OTC. OTC market, they manage public stock exchange, which is not listed on NASDAQ. American Stock Exchange and New York Stock Exchange, New York Stock Exchange, the OTC market dealing with companies are usually small companies that can be traded in cheap and has less regulations. They have very less regulation, which are also called as a small market as for small companies. So these are over the counter market. Second one is called as bond market. A financial market is a place where investor 
loan money on bond and as security for a set if time at a predefined rate of interest bonds are issued by corporations states municipalities and federal governments across the world so these are the markets are there usually it goes with like financial marketplace where investor loan money bond security these kind of things will be happening in bond market next go to money market they trade high liquid and short maturities and leading of security that mature is less than a year always in the previous class also i told you so what is a money market money market always goes with short term usually it starts from 14 days it will go up to one year up to one year whatever that trading happens that we call it as money market in the money market always we go with the short term lesser than one year next even when you go for lesser than one year always the return will be what always less only now types of financial market you already completed the money market then we'll go with your financial market type under financial market type we already learned what is a over the counter bond market money market and the next one is your forex market and derivatives market what is derivatives they created security that determine its future value from its primary asset the derivatives contract value is regulated by market price of the primary item derivatives means what your stock shares now your future value will be decided now only how it is decided we assume that in after 7 days the value will be 10000 after 8 days the value will be 12000 your future value will be decided now and you will buy that particular trade after buying that if there is any variation in the market you have almost 7 working 7 days including non working day also so 7 days in that 7 days you can sell and you can keep it with you automatically at the end of 7 day automatically the shares or stock will get sold so usually the bank nifty or nifty traded when every thursday will be the expiry if you go with the fin nifty it is always the expiry date is what is tuesday so like this your derivative market works then forex market it is a financial market where investor trade in currencies in the entire world this is the most liquid financial market forex means what foreign exchange your currency so you every day you keep checking what is the price of gold what is the price of your foreign currencies every day the value of currency varies in paisas yesterday it was like your um, dollars only for example it is 82 next day if you see it can be 81.5 or 82.75 like that it keep varying so in that also you can trade next once you done with your types of your financial market next we'll go with the functions of financial market now mentioned below are the important functions of the financial market like it mobilizes saving by trading it in the most productive methods so there are most productive methods are there if you go to any stock exchange there are many stock exchanges are there i don't want to mention the names there are many stock brokers are there when you enroll with the stock brokers along with buying and selling of shares they keep giving the tips like this is a share you can buy this is a stock you can buy this is a share or stock you can hold for one month these kind of ideas these kind of tips they keep giving and at the end they will mention all the tips are on educational basis why educational basis means they cannot give guarantee for stock market even though they can assume they can predict that the 100 rupees share will go to 200 at the end of one year but they cannot give you guarantee it may go to 300 also or as 100 rupees stock will go to zero also because it depends on market you just predict what will happen in the future but you cannot give confirmation or guarantee what will going to happen in future you can just say that it will rain in another 10 minutes you can predict but you cannot give 100% guarantee or sure that 
it is going to align in 100 in 10 minutes. The reason is very simple, which are not in our hand. Next, it assists in deciding the security price by interaction with the investor. Like the current price is going around 1300 or 1400. You can wait till, yeah, let it go to 1200. You can predict that, let it come to 1100, then I will buy. This kind of prediction or decision can be taken with the help of experts. It gives liquidity to bottled asset. Earlier it was like what you were sharing, like you have a gold, somebody has silver or some food, you used to exchange with the, this thing and with the food. When you're sharing your gold with food, you're in need of food, but is it worth for that food giving gold? No, gold is very expensive compared to your food item, but when you're in need, no other option, you have to exchange gold with the food only. Then the 1000 rupees worth gold, you're paying just for 100 rupees food. Like there is no, you cannot compare, but when you are in need, you have to exchange. That was your barter system. Earlier stage, the kings are royal people. They used to exchange gold for food. They used to exchange gold for some necessary. But now there is no that kind of inequality. Now everywhere it is equality, you are exchanging with cash. Your bottled asset can be converted to what? Liquidity money. Less time consuming and cost effective as parties don't have to spend extra time and money to find potential client. So already there is an application is there, already there is a stock broker sir, there. You no need to search for the customer. You no need to search for the investor. Everything is ready made. Just go there, check, analyze, invest. Done. So they have made very user friendly and it is a less time consuming. You cannot go, you have no need to go to Infosys website and check one by one what is Infosys. If you go just gist of Infosys, it will give you what are the consequences, what are the do's and what are the don'ts. They will give you SWOT analysis of every company. This will help you whether you should buy this share or whether you should sell this share. They will give you whether you should buy, whether you should hold, whether you should sell. For all the other things, buying 80%, hold 10%, sell 10%. Then what you will do? Instead of analyzing and uh, realizing everything, if you do this, see this chart, oh, 80% are saying that buy this blindly will go and buy. The reason is what somebody, some experts already done all the analysis. They have given us a report. It is a time consuming. Hope you are clear. I'll give you a simple example. So you one year you'll work, you work hard and you will get your result. Your parents or your neighbors, what they will do? They will not see what you did one year, how much you studied. They will see your marks card. In the marks card, you score 95, 98, 100. They will judge that, yeah, this student is brilliant. This student worked hard. All the complete year you worked hard, but in the result, it is only 35. They will decide you have not studied. You have wasted your time. Just looking at your marks, they will decide what you are. Similarly, this also, it is a less time consuming. Everything is ready made. No need to spend time on analyzing. Classification, yes. The financial market can be classified into three different forms by the nature of claim, debt market, equity market, by the maturity claim, money market and capital market. By the nature of climb, there is a type 1 debt market and equity market. In the maturity of climb, it will be money market as well as capital market. Already we learned what is the difference between money market and capital market. SEBI guidelines for listing of shares. SEBI guidelines of listing of shares, minimum listing requirement, minimum requirement for companies, then permission to use the name of the BSE Bombay Stock Exchange, submission of letter of application, allotment of security trading permission, a requirement of 1% security payment of listing fees. These are the 
SEBI, Security Exchange Board of India, all your stock market, your shares, everything is listed and the transaction is happening on the basis of what? SEBI guidelines. So this is what all your financial market instrument. So very small topic in this, you have to learn what are the financial market instrument and the types, function as well as features. At the end you have to learn about the functions of SEBI also. Thank you.